The stacks of division championship hats have been sitting on the shelves of the team store at Dodger Stadium for nearly three weeks now collecting dust as fans walk in and out looking for gear before game one of the National League Division Series on Saturday against the Arizona Diamondbacks. They walk past the shelves as if they were filled with plant-based hot dogs and unsalted potato chips. You'll have to excuse Dodger fans if they aren't throwing the team a parade for winning 100 games in a division title, which would be cause for celebration in most cities. The Dodgers are in the midst of an unprecedented run in the franchise's storied history. They have won the National League West division title 10 of the past 11 seasons and will play in their 11th straight National League division series this weekend. They have won at least 100 games in the past four complete seasons and were on pace to win a record-tying 116 games during the pandemic-shortened season of 2020 when they won their lone World Series title since 1988 in the Texas bubble. Last season, they won 111 games, the most by a Major League Baseball team in 20 years before losing to the San Diego Padres. All of that is in the past for Dodger fans as they prepare for another postseason run. Every Dodger fan has a pregame tradition and ritual when going to Dodger Stadium that makes the experience so much bigger than the result and brings them back season after season. For years, I would go to Philippe's, the inventor of the French dip sandwich, and get a beef dip prior to games with my dad. I later transitioned into the flaming margarita and taquitos at El Compadre, down the street from Dodger Stadium, when I got a little bit older. The hope for fans is these trips to Dodger Stadium will result in a World Series title championship, one in front of the fans in Los Angeles during a non-pandemic season for the first time since 1988. If it doesn't happen this year, there is no doubt they will be back next season, expecting the Hollywood ending that has thus far eluded them.